Hello everyone, this is King Kony LT. This video I will show you how to use DS18B20 temperature sensor work with Arduino IDE. You can see this is the service monitor. You can see the temperature I detect from the DS20B18 temperature sensor. Let's look at this part. Uh, this part is for temperature sensor. Uh, you can connect with this three line. This red is what? And this yellow is the signal. And this black is the ground. So now I have only connected with one sensor. If you have used more sensors, like two sensors, three sensors, or first four sensors, just connect together is OK. Because every sensor has different address. OK, now let's look at the Arduino ID, the program for this temperature sensor. Before you use DS18B20 sensor, you need to install the library. That will be very easy to use this sensor. Just click the library manage and we can input DS18B20 and we'll search this library. Just use this one. Uh, we have already installed. Uh, you just install online and uh, after you install, you just click close. And then you will see the example. And uh, find the DS18B. You can see the multi. We can click this this one. And uh, we'll open this soft source code. I have already opened. So the first, uh, you just uh, to change this DS pin, IO pin. You can see this is our ESP32 module. Uh, this is for date uh, temperature. This is for 16 pin, but this means IO13. So we can just uh, change the words because uh, default is 2, and I change it to 13. Only change this. And also, you can change this delay time. This have every 10 seconds uh, refresh the date. We can let it quickly. And uh, you can press the upload. Now we'll come play and download with for a moment. We can close this window. Uh, when you running the program, we can click the toy, the server monitor. And uh, we can change the brand route at this uh, because we have initialized for this band rate. Uh, so this needed to as a thing. OK, now you can see this is the feedback. This is address. Uh, this is address is decimal format. Uh, this is for DS18B20 uh, sensor. If you have another, this address will be different. And this is revolution. And this power external. And this is the temperature uh, by unit C or by unit F. So this is 28 centigrade. I can use my hand, wait for a moment. Now you can see the temperature is become high. It's 32. So this is for refresh time, just uh, set by this delay time. I can let it quickly, like uh, 5,000, and upload again. And clear, and we can press this button to reset. Now you can see uh, the value is feedback, and about every five seconds will feedback. Uh, they will be faster than before. Okay, it's up. So let's look at the code. Uh, this is all sample code for this demo. And the important, just uh, you can use this one to get the temperature value. Uh, if you want to get the unit C, just use this function. And if you use get the temperature by unit F, just by this function. So you can see there is a different uh, value uh, by different unit. And uh, the firstly, you need to define the pin, pin code and uh, 
just to read the temperature is OK. So the value will be displayed. So you can use this value for compare, like for alarm message, for input sensor, check the relay output, just compare with this value is OK. OK, this is a simple demo video about the temperature sensor use. OK, see you on next lesson.